overwhelming and constant, right? So what you're describing is the attention economy. Yeah. This notion that the thing that is for sale, even though these apps may be free, especially social media apps, is your own, is our, our us as the users, our attention is the, the product that is yeah, for the sale. Is, is us. It is. It absolutely <laughs> is. And I think that um, we need to know that we are up against a very rigged fight. Meaning if we think we're going to be able to engage with technology, especially with because algorithms and the entire um, design of the product, meaning the, the social network platform, is designed to sell our attention, uh, there's a lot of investment, whether that's teams of engineers, uh, et cetera. And it's effective. I mean, meaning that, yeah, our, we, our attention is the thing that is on there quite for, for quite some time. The main point, though, is not so much that we're in this system. We are in this system. And it is, I think, that we're going to need some intervention, not just from ourselves, but kind of structurally, kind of globally, culturally. And some countries Yeah, you could see in Australia. I mean, Australia just exactly. banned social media for kids under 16. Exactly. I think there's going to be some things that people are going to wake up to to say, oh, it's not, it's not just annoying and uncomfortable and makes me feel bad. It's bad. It's not good for me to do this. And that it's not fair. It's not fair to, to be selling my attention when I'm not aware that you're that's what you're doing. 